guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I'm Jessica, and today I'm sharing with you guys something really, really exciting. So if you can't tell, I'm sitting in our new camper, and I am so excited to give you guys a tour of it today. This is something that I have wanted for such a long time, and it has finally happened, and I'm so excited. And I'm so excited to share it with you guys and to make content and like camping content and um, just bring you guys along for this journey with us. But it's really, really cute and I'm so excited. So I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys the tour. All right, so this is the outside. It's the Palomino Backpack Edition. I'll try and put in the description box what model it is because I have no idea. And it is a 2017. So I'm just gonna quickly go through some of the things on the outside because I don't, I think it's kind of boring and we probably, probably don't care, but just in case somebody's watching, um, we have where we hook it up to the power here and we have our water connection and we have cable and satellite here, which if anyone wants to tell me about this, I would like to know because I, I'm intrigued that you can hook satellite up to this, but I don't know how. Um, this is if you have, it is set up for if you have solar panels and then we do have an outdoor shower. I think this is locked right now and I didn't bring the keys with me, but basically if you just unlock that, it has a hose in it and it's hooked up to the water so you can hose off outside, which is really nice, especially because we have dogs and they will be coming with us a lot of times um, so we can give them a bath outdoors before we go in. And then this is probably locked. Nope, this is where our propane tank is because a lot of the things will run off of gas. Okay, and then we have, these are the power lifts that, there's four of them, so there's one there, and then there's one there, and on the other side, and this is what, we have a remote control, and we bring them down, and they, we can level it out, and then, then we can pull the truck out from underneath of it, and so that's how you would set it up at the campsite, and so then you can just pull your truck out, and it, it would obviously be lower to the ground as well. We do have some storage here where we just keep like our things. We hook it up when we're hooking it up to the truck. How do you, how do you close these? Oh, there we go. This is where we store the, um, whatever these are called, <laughs> where we hook it to the frame of the truck basically. So we just store them in here. It has tons of storage, which is really, really nice. So I did, put the slide out so you guys could see what that looks like from the outside yeah it just comes out a few feet but it definitely adds a ton of space on the inside <laughs> Okay, so this is the back and I have some trash that I brought out of there that my daughter left in there the other day when she was in there. But we do have this little keypad to get in, which I think is really cool. This is a 2017 Palomino backpack edition. And so yeah, anyways, we have a code. You can use the key obviously, or you can punch in a code, which I think is really cool. So we're gonna go ahead and open it up and I'll show you what the inside looks like. Okay, once you step up here and you open the door, this is what you see when you come in. So this is the little dinah area and this does turn into a bed. You just put the table legs, you can take them off and then the table lays right here and then you lay the cushions down and you have a bed and that's where the girls will be sleeping. There is a fly in here. I don't know if you guys can hear it. <laughs> but anyways, this is where we came in. We stepped up. And this is the slide out. <laughs> and 
and here is the bathroom and I will show you that in just a minute. We have all of the control panel things for the awning and the slide out and the lights and everything and our tanks is all right here when you walk in. And then the next thing over to the left is the kitchen. And I really love the wood color in here. I'm really happy with it. So I'm not going to be changing anything like that. I will be decorating and stuff in here a little bit to make it ours, but I love the wood color. So I do have a microwave. It's little, but it's enough. It's big enough. And then we have the gas stove and it has this little cover and it has three burners. And I do have a light above it and then the little exhaust fan for when I'm cooking. And then I have a double sink here with my little window. And then here is the radio and it plays music inside and outside. It's got a CD player, a USB, an auxiliary in and Bluetooth. So that's pretty cool. And then I have a bunch of storage over here. This is like the pantry. So it's got spots where you can move the shelves or put more in there if you need. It's even got a place if you wanted to use it like as a coat closet, I guess. So you can hang stuff. But this will I'll probably just be using as a pantry. And then below it, it has drawers. There's a drawer below the oven. Oh, I forgot to show you. It does have an oven so we can make pizza, cookies, or whatever we want to make while we're camping. And then there's some storage here. More storage here. And then when you turn to the right, we have our fridge and it's a pretty nice size fridge and it's locked so it doesn't come open. You have to push this button and you've got the fridge. And the same with we have a little freezer. And then you can step up here and this is where our bed is. And this is a queen size bed. And there is tons of storage up here. It's like crazy how much storage there is. And there is a TV up there. And you can turn this TV to see if you want to watch it while you're sitting and eating. Or while you're in bed or whatever. And then it does push back in there. Which is really nice. And then this is basically like a little dresser. All kinds of storage here. There's storage there. That Those are really deep storage too. And then there's plugins up there by the bed so you can charge your phones at night. And then those little lights come on. Some more storage. There's a window on both sides as well. We do have a fan up here also, which is nice. And then this is like a closet and it has where you can hang stuff. So I can hang shirts or whatever if you were gonna be in here long-term. And then that does lift up and there's storage down in there as well. And up here on the roof is our AC slash heater. So I have it off right now because it's really loud, but I had it run into cool down in here so I could film for you guys without melting. But that is our AC unit right there. And our smoke detector, there's a speaker there. And then there is another fan and a really cool thing I just figured out yesterday is if you click this switch here, it actually turns on some lights here to kind of guide your path at night. If it's dark and you want to just turn on a little light and you can see. So I thought that was pretty cool. Okay. So now I'm going to show you guys the bathroom, which is crazy that this thing has room for a bathroom, but it does. Here it is. We have a little medicine cabinet and the little vanity, as well as some storage under here and some access to the sink stuff. And then the toilet. And this does lift out so you can drain the water when you are showering. And there is the shower. And it does have a shower curtain. I haven't even messed with it, but I guess it comes around here. So I'm assuming like if you want to leave the door open and shower that way you have a little bit more arm room. I'll probably get a different shower curtain for in here, but this is fine for now. Let me show you guys. Let me step in here. 
and show you the medicine cabinet. So that's pretty nice. There's lots of storage for some first aid things and like Tylenol and whatnot. Some toiletries maybe. Um, then the little toilet paper thing is right here as you can see. And let's see if I can turn around in here and show you. So when you look out, there is the dinette. So that is awesome that we have a shower. I'm really, really excited about having our own bathroom and shower. So that's the tour of our new camper. I hope you guys loved it. I think it's super cute and just perfect for our family. It's all that we need and I'm super excited to give it my touch and to decorate in here and just make it ours. So if you guys want to see those videos and that content, definitely stay tuned because I will be sharing anything that I do in here. I'm going to be doing a clean with me in here because it does have some cobwebs and it just needs cleaned. Um, so I'm definitely going to try and film a clean with me in here and it's going to be kind of crazy because like I'm filming right now with my iPhone because my camera just doesn't have a wide enough angle to get it in the frame in here. So I'm going to be filming it with my iPhone and try to hopefully be able to get a good enough angle for you guys to be able to enjoy it. But I am going to give it a really good scrub down from top to bottom. And then I'm also going to be organizing it with some stuff. I'm planning on going to the Dollar Tree and getting a bunch of stuff and getting it all ready for camping because we will be going camping really soon. So I'm so excited to share it with you guys. I hope you will stay tuned. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you hit that red subscribe button. That way you'll be notified when I upload. And don't forget to leave me a thumbs up before you head out. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.